This video made its way to TikTok, but it was shared hundreds of times on Facebook. A Chinese restaurant in town closed down after a viral video caused a firestorm. Yeah, this video appears to show show raw meat thawing outside in a utility sink behind this restaurant while other food is then stored on the floor. Health inspectors are now working to find out what's going on inside Lee Chinese Kitchen on US 19 in Port Ritchie. Seriously, this is uh, is worth the watch. Even 10 News reporter Bo Zimmer had his microphone ripped out of his hand. It's all in this week's restaurant. Red Alert. At the little Chinese place, look what he got the meat throwing out of it. Video posted on Instagram appears to show a Port Ritchie restaurant thawing meat and other frozen food outside in the sunlight. They got the meat throwing out like came this nasty thing outside. The video was shot by a worker looking for a hose to fill up his bucket. Yeah, I was like, whoa, what, what is this? Yeah, yeah that, that wasn't cool at all. Jay White is the man behind the camera. He says he returned a short time later to confront employees of Lee's Chinese Kitchen over how they were handling the food. No. This is what you serve people? No. You cook that for people? No, we wash it. Y'all wash the meat in there? Yeah. Well, that's dirt. That's sink. That sink is dirtier than the arm. It's dirtier than the, the, the meat. The video also documents what appears to be oh, food oh, stored yeah. on the floor. Y'all got noodles right there. Y'all got the meat on the floor in here. You can't do that, man. When an employee attempts to take the meat back inside, White objects. No, take that meat to the dumpster. Ma'am, why is you putting that meat? You're going to serve that meat to people. You need to take that to the dumpster right there. You need to take that meat and throw it away. No. Oh, you're cooking that for people? Okay. Ooh. We showed the video to food safety expert and former health inspector Danielle Egger. I don't see anything in here that would be approved by the code. We can't right. thaw meat in a mop sink. We can't thaw meat outside. Egger has questions about how long the meat was allowed to sit in the sun and serious concerns about possible contamination. We're dumping our mop water in that sink. We're dumping chemicals in that sink. We have, who knows what's going on? That sink is outside. We don't know what's going on in that sink when the business is closed. Records show Lee's Chinese Kitchen has failed to meet state inspection standards on eight out of their last 10 inspections since 2018. The state filed an administrative complaint fining the restaurant for repeat violations related to food handling, temperature abuse, insects, and possible cross-contamination. This week, 10 News stopped by but found the restaurant locked up. This man who works in the same strip mall came outside and ordered us off the property. Okay. Stop filming. Okay. Now. No, we're not stopping filming. We're not stopping. You better let that man. Hey, man, what you doing? Why are you tripping? Oh. Who are you with? Doesn't matter who I'm with. Just, and while not everyone was happy. So now it's making me think. Renee Canoro often orders takeout from the restaurant. It says it's important for customers to know how their food is being handled. When I saw that what that guy posted on Facebook, I just immediately felt disgusting. I felt so sick. She says she's yeah. grateful the video ended up on social yeah. media What's for everyone right to see. For? What would your message be to, to the management on, on what they need to change? Everything. They need to reevaluate their situation in there and clean everything up and start over. And tonight, Bo tells us that Lee's Chinese Kitchen is still closed. The restaurant has not returned to any of our calls. State health inspectors are aware of that video that was posted online. They're trying to inspect the restaurant, but so far, far they have not been able to get inside. The state says it will continue checking back just in case the restaurant attempts to reopen.